Welcome. This is an example geography project where I take you on a short tour of Hong Kong as a way of demonstrating the potential Google Earth Studio has and the affordances it can bring to a class project. Hong Kong was first occupied 6,000 years ago in the Neolithic period. Hong Kong of today is comprised of 18 different districts. You will see some of the more important ones shown on the screen as we fly around the island itself. Each district is comprised of multiple areas, from factories and warehouses to bedroom communities in high-rise buildings. Hong Kong Island proper is 1,106 square kilometers, or 427 square miles. If we include Kowloon, the total area of the region is 2,755 square kilometers, or 1,064 square miles. For comparison, New York is 110 times larger than Hong Kong. With a population of 7.392 million people, Hong Kong is one of the most densely populated places on the earth. The population of Hong Kong has more than doubled since 1960 when 3 million people lived here. But because the geographic space has not increased, this has caused Hong Kong to be the fourth most highly densely populated regions of the world. The other three countries are Singapore for third, Monaco second, and Macau first. Hong Kong is a vertical city, having over 9,000 high-rise buildings. Of these, more than 1,500 are taller than 100 meters, or 328 feet tall, which qualifies them as being a skyscraper and there are over 350 buildings that are taller than 150 meters, or 492 feet tall. The average apartment size in Hong Kong is approximately 160 square feet. Hong Kong became a British colony in 1842 at the end of the First Opium War. In 1860, UK took over the Kowloon Peninsula at the end of the Second Opium War. The major sources of income for Hong Kong has historically been trade. It is perfectly situated to transport goods from China to the West. However, today, while Hong Kong still has major sources of income from shipping and trade, its primary source of money is in financial trading, and these buildings make up the financial district of Hong Kong. Hong Kong globally ranks as the seventh largest trading economy with GDP of US $340 billion per year. There is another side to Hong Kong besides high-rise buildings and financial districts. Only 25% of Hong Kong's territories have been developed for use. 40% of Hong Kong has been reserved for country parks and water reserves. It is a very common practice to go hiking through the mountains of the New Territories as a way to escape the mega metropolis that is Hong Kong and Kowloon. I hope this brief demonstration of Google Earth Studio and the potential it has as a educational tool will inspire you to give it a try yourself with your students or just for fun. I encourage you to go and sign up for a free account with Google Earth Studio. I hope you enjoyed my short tour of Hong Kong.